We are in the cargo hold number two on the SS Lane Victory, and we've turned this cargo hold into a museum. Uh, one of the big artifacts we have is the Sand Pebbles engine, the one used in the movie with Steve McQueen. Uh, we acquired this engine from the gentleman that bought it from the studios after they had made the movie. We're standing alongside the Sand Pebbles engine, the one used in the movie with Steve McQueen. This uh, is a triple expansion engine. Simply that means they use the steam three times through three cylinders, three pistons, and the steam comes from the boiler at about 200 pounds and goes through the high pressure piston driving it down. It's only about uh, a foot and a half in diameter. After it leaves that piston, having driven the piston rod down, it goes over to the intermediate piston, which is twice the size, moving it up. Again, it exhausts from there to the low pressure system. Now you have something over four feet in diameter. The pressure of the steam has dropped going through the engine. Consequently, they get the same horsepower, just having bigger pistons, and they call this the triple expansion. They use the steam three times. To better illustrate just how this triple expansion works, this is the high pressure piston, the piston that gets the steam at 200 pounds. When it leaves that piston, it moves over to the intermediate piston. You notice the diameter is quite a bit larger and it'll give out the same amount of horsepower that the steam has dropped from about 200 pounds to down to 80 to 90 pounds. After that leaves driving that piston down, it exhausts over to the low pressure piston. As you can see, it's very large. There's only about 30 pounds of steam, but they get the same horsepower from all three pistons because of the size. And this engine is run when we take the cruises. We run the engine and reverse it so you can actually see how this operates. It's very fascinating to watch the, the motion that takes place.